What's up guys, I'm Emma and I've been streaming on Twitch for about a month now so I wanted to make this video to let you guys know what my experience has been like. As you may already know, I run this YouTube channel with Christian and so we originally started streaming on Twitch together. We spent roughly a month trying to get the stream working perfectly so that we could switch between both of our perspectives. So we effectively had like two streams in one. However, it didn't quite pan out how we expected and after a few streams of different games, we realised that no one was actually watching. This was a major setback for us, but we still really wanted to stream. So we decided that I would stream on my own for a little while. Judging by how well other female streamers do on Twitch, we figured that people would be more likely to click on a stream with my face on it rather than both of us. And from what we've seen so far, it seems like we were correct. While I've tried streaming a few different games, I've mainly focused on CSGO as that's the game that I wanted to improve at. It turns out that that also got me a lot of followers. I tried mixing up the stream by playing different games, but ultimately nothing compared to the popularity of CSGO. This is both good and bad because if you're streaming a game that's popular, you know that you're going to be consistently growing and your followers are also going to come back to see how you're doing. However, it's also bad because with our channel we wanted to focus on streaming new games too and it's easy to feel locked into a game that does well like CS. Back to my main point, I know that the reason I'm getting so many people click on my stream is because I'm a girl. I don't have any statistics to back up my claim, but I'm pretty sure the majority of people playing and watching CS go are male, so to see a girl streaming it is probably slightly more interesting. When I'm playing solo, people are often surprised that they have a girl on their team, so it's no surprise that people would be more interested in watching a girl streaming than a guy necessarily. That's not to say there's a shortage of female Twitch streamers, there's certainly a lot of them and some of them are really popular. However, I think we can sort them into two separate categories. You have the regular kind of female streamer who just wants to play games, and then the Twitch cam girl type. I understand why cam girls do what they do, but it's kind of ruining it for the rest of us. I often get people dropping into the stream and asking whether I want to be boosted, which was quite a surprise to me. This may be normal for cam girls who are used to just sitting there and looking pretty, but I actually want to play the game and learn it, hence the label on my stream that says Road to MG2. So I've gained just over 100 followers over the course of a month, and I've already had some subscriptions too. This is amazing considering the fact that I've only been streaming for less than 40 hours or something like that. But the thing that's most important to me is the people that have come to my stream and stayed around. I feel like I've made some friends and they'll come and hang out in most of my streams, we'll get to have a chat and hang out and it's just really nice. I feel like at this point I'm streaming for those guys and if it's just those guys that are watching I'm really okay with that. It therefore seems like now is the perfect time to reintroduce Christian to the stream. So we're going to be streaming together a few times a week because we want to cover co-op games and some new titles when possible. I'll still be streaming CS now and again, but expect to see a lot more of both of us on Twitch. Just to be clear, YouTube is still our main focus. Recently we've struggled to put videos out because we're lacking in new content, but for the next few months we've got some stuff lined up, so you've got some videos to look forward to. Thanks for checking out this video if you happen to watch till the end. Uh, let me know what you think of Twitch streams in general in the comments below. I'd be really interested to see what you think of female Twitch streamers and you know the expectations of viewers on those streamers. Please remember to subscribe to our channel too as we're going to be putting out more videos in the coming weeks. Have a good day and we'll see you in our next stream or video. Thank you.